Back in this box canyon to talk to a new owner about putting a pond in his property. Great little drive, beautiful little canyon. He's one of three people that would live back in here. There's a couple already here. I think he was actually staying in a yurt behind the house that he's redoing. This is gorgeous. Beautiful property. Hey guys, Pond Man here. I'm out here talking to a guy about a swim pond as I'm leaving his property. This thing in his front yard. Check these two out. Six pointer over there? Look at that little girl. Look at that. Maybe I can catch him again on the way out because I got to double back in that direction. Guys, I am really enjoying this property. This is beautiful. Check this stuff out. Okay, while I was talking to the homeowner, I was asking him about these structures I passed on the way in. Here I am coming up on them now on the way out. He said he was talking to some of the old timers here, and these things have been here since the 1800s. The stories, he said, but nobody's really sure what the real meaning is. Here we go, we're back in Amish country almost. Here, see the, here's the structure we were talking about. Not sure what it is or was, but it's pretty cool looking. See, it almost looks like some of it's made to have water running down on it. I don't know where they would get the... Still going my way out of this property. Thought I'd tell you a little bit more about what he told us. He said this road here that we're on now originally was one of the original stagecoach runs for this area. Again, this is just going on what he was told, but it kind of makes sense by the age of some of the structures and stuff like that. Either way, what a neat place.